gave some, but some gave their all. Salute. Williams shotgun snap, straight drop, four-man rush. They pick it up, looking deep, steps up in the pocket. Going to wing it for the end zone for Mims. He comes back for it. He caught it! He... Take off the blazer, <laughs> loosen up the top, step aside the booth, Superman is alive. <laughs> so it's really cool to see him keep keep excelling and keep getting better and then you know just finding a, I mean we found a bunch of receivers today all over the field all day. So it was really really good to see him playing like that and you know distributing the wealth. Leaping defenders in a single bound Crunch time, four down Forget next, I'm here now Thirteen, this ain't luck, this is all grind Tony Montana staring at the blimp, it's all mine Not just the Big 12, the world Chico And everything in it, if I said it, then I meant it If we want it, we can win it all Lord willing, ambition, we too deep Committee saying we bad guys, that's too sweet Winning games by a razor's edge No looking back as we gaze ahead Trust the truth, shun the lies Step inside the booth, Superman is alive Trap house You broke the boys off with this one, Darkstar Salute Trap House The OU Sooners, fresh off a much needed bye week Heading to Waco, Texas to take on the Baylor Bears Something's telling me Baylor will be fired up for this one They would love to spoil the Sooner Natty hopes And the committee would relish in the opportunity To stare into the eyes of Sooner Nation and say See, we told you so I'm expecting the Bears to show up with a lot of vigor And a lot of fight early It will be imperative for OU to withstand the early revenant Keep our composure and be slow and methodical to overcome the early onslaught of emotional energy Baylor will come out with. Slow is smooth, smooth is fast. Let's be smooth. I'm expecting Lincoln to have these boys firing on all four cylinders coming off the bye. OU will bring in the nation's number five scoring offense on this road trip. Oklahoma is 9-1 in their last 10 outings after a bye week, and we need this trend to continue. On the defensive side, Baylor struggled immensely on the road at TCU, giving up 30 points to a Patterson-less Horn Frog ball club. But the Bears are 5-0 at home so far this season, so this is by no means a cakewalk, bro. The current spread has the Sooners at around six point favorites on most sports booking sites. And your boy Big Trap thinks the Sooners will cover this one touchdown spread. The total sits at around 62, which I foresee the game could possibly go over, but I'm not a big totals guy, but I got OU winning by at least 10, if not more. Baylor does not have what it takes to deal with what we can summon in the getting players in space department. The quick screen game will be the proper prescription for a Sooner victory. Then after we spread them out, hopefully we can find ourselves in more advantageous positions to check into some favorable run calls. Gotta get Marcus Major some of those reps, you know. And I love what Kennedy's doing. And when he has a healthy diet of 20 carries, we win, bro. Vice versa on the defensive side, bro. We have to win the favorable matchups, especially in the run game. Baylor averages 230 a game on the ground, bro, which is a top 
billing position in the Big 12. Abram Smith, he's a physical running back. He runs well behind his pads. He's got a little wiggle in those hips too, bro. He's shifty. We must rally to the ball and contain the young fella. You look at Baylor, you're talking about a team that consistently through the course of the season, uh, the ability to run the football and then hit explosives through the air. Um, so, it, uh, no, it'll be a, a, another absolute uh, a battle. Down the point. It's going to take a full 11-man effort to get the job done defensively, bro, because Baylor's offense is more than respectable. I'm not going to jive you, man. They're explosive. Solid up front. I love their two guards. They're big. They're physical. They move. They dominated Texas with the pin and pull scheme. And a lot of it's predicated on that power run game, man. Out the two back set to give you a little zone game out the one back. So Redmond, Perrion, IT, Nick, Caleb. Shoot, I want to see Danny get some rotation this week too. Y'all got to dominate this week, bro. This by far will be the biggest test for Coach Grinch and the speed defense. But if we just win our individual battles, stay gap disciplined, and by the grace of the good Lord, wrap up on the back end and secure the tackles, hey man, we should be leaving Texas with a new bearskin rug for the palace. I tell you what, bro, there's a big trophy sitting at the crest of this tumultuous mountain they want us to get to the top of. And all we got to do is keep chipping away at the inefficiencies and keep climbing. So march on. March on down the field. Chain gang salute. North Star, I see you, player. Boomer sooner. Trap house. Trap house. Oh, you boys, they my brothers, they my friends. Oh, you boys, they my brothers, they my friends. Oh, you boys, they my brothers, they my friends. Oh, you boys, they my brothers, they my friends. Coming off the edge like Benito, bending quarterbacks like Neo. There's only one we know, he know, she know I got that work. Shorty trying to kick it like Turk, kick it like Gabe. It's all good in the palace. Trap got it made like Alice Brooks breaking hearts in Dallas. Caleb made his name in the Cotton Bowl. You know the vibes, horns down everywhere we go.